This is Channel 2 News, coverage you can count on. Tracy Davis is our new superintendent. In a surprise move, just an hour ago, the Washoe County Board of Trustees voted to make the interim superintendent permanent. How they made the decision tops Channel 2 News at 6.30. Well, as many of you remember, Tracy Davis was appointed the interim superintendent after the ousting of Pedro Martinez last year. Good evening, I'm Kristen Remington. I'm Wendy DeMonte. Thank you for staying with us tonight. Well, Davis has served in that position, like you said, since October. And the, tonight, the Board of Trustees voted to retain her for that job rather than search for new candidates. Ariana Bennett joins us now live from the school district headquarters with the very latest. Ari. Yeah, ladies, I don't think most people were expecting them to make a decision today, but of course they did end up making that decision. They decided to hold a vote in the end, voting six to one to retain Tracy Davis as superintendent. And we caught up with her right after the vote. Here's what she had to say. Well, of course I'm very excited and, and I'm very happy, but at the end of the day, we have, we have work to do. Like tomorrow I'm gonna wake up with the same schedule, but knowing that I'm going to be the superintendent and continue to work and, and do collaborations with our community, with our schools, um, with our parents, there's work to be done still. So it's not like I get to wake up and say, oh, I got a new job. Now Davis says her first priority as superintendent is raising graduation rates and not letting any students slip through the cracks. Along with the strong support from the trustees, Davis had several community leaders speak on her behalf, including current and former district employees. And we spoke with Nick Smith, the one dissenting trustee. He says he's not against Davis. He just wanted a more extensive search process that involved getting more input from parents. Now, other trustees told us that wasn't necessary. Our parents are the ones with the kids in the district, and I would have liked to have given them the opportunity to have a voice. I've seen the work that she's done for the past three years. You know, if you look at our graduation rates and the work that we're doing here in the school district, Tracy Davis has been behind that all along. And Davis does take over the position effective immediately. Covering Big Story Live, Ariana Bennett, Channel 2 News.